Hi, my name is Jen and welcome to my YouTube channel. I'm Jen's in the vents, Jen's in the vents. And I just got a haircut today, so it just feels so silky smooth. She added this chocolate thing for, a chocolate thing for, um, to keep it straight. So we'll see if it works. If it does, I'm going to share it with you guys because you guys know I love sharing products, things, food, everything that I love. And if I don't love it, I just won't share it. But yeah, look, she parted it in the middle. I normally never do my hair like this. I always have it either my part on this side or this side. But yeah, let me know. What do you guys think? All right. So this video is about perfumes. Yes, ladies and gent, I know you guys want to know what I wear or uh what's new out there or the best perfume to give to someone to a loved one uh i have all of my perfumes my collection right behind me so we're gonna go from the cheapest to the most expensive to what's out to what's in what i used in high school what i used in college what i use right now so stay tuned to the end because i will be showing you some new perfume uh, that we discovered there's this place that they sell candles and it's going to be my new perfume for the summer and then also my other favorite perfume that i've been using since last year that everybody's been complimenting on just how it smells yes and the way i spray myself i always spray behind of my neck because when i hug someone or you know i like to smell myself if my hair is like moving around, I'll spray, I'll smell myself. So I like to spray the back of my neck, the front of my neck, and then on each wrist. I don't, they don't recommend for you to do this. No, because then it takes away from the aromas. So yes, let's begin. This is my perfume collection. Yay! I'm going to be talking about all of my perfumes. I'm going to give you guys my opinions, my thoughts, my recommendations. First of all, always keep your perfumes away from a window. And there's my candle. You don't want to let light hit your perfumes, not even light. I keep my perfumes inside of my closet. And this is just a little uh, shelf that I got at Marshall's. It has a mirror. And I thought it was cute at first, but now I don't like it as much. Let me know. Uh, if you guys have any recommendations for just something, a little shelf to hold all of my perfumes. So let's start over here. These are by Kim Kardashian. You can stand them up like this or you could just lay them down. I usually just have them like this. Well, I don't have this one. This one's my daughter's. But I wanted to include it because I did buy all three. The BFF one, I think it was a pink one. I gave it to my BFF. I kept the wifey. This one, um, I don't recommend it. It smells like baby powder. So it's not even wifey material at all. So yeah, don't waste your money. Don't get that one. This one, it's kind of cute. It's kind of fun. You could give this to your baby girl, your daughter, your girlfriend, someone young. Yeah, this one smells cute. It smells young. Okay, this one's an old one. I used this one, I think, in college. Um, it's stained because the pump, it stopped working. It's by Ariana Grande. And it does smell, it smells fun. I think it's a floral because that is my thing. I'm more into florals, but um, it's not that popular. I don't recommend it. This one is Nicki Minaj. This one for sure, it smells cheap. It smells like a stripper. But I got this because of the bottle. And I love Nicki Minaj. I went to her concert and she's she's so much fun. So yeah, this one, it's I don't recommend it unless it's just like your decoration or I don't know, it's really cute. I love it, but it doesn't smell good. So I don't recommend that. One. Okay, this one, it is the Flower Bomb by Victor Rolf. And it smells very lovely. I recommend it for your wife, for your girlfriend, for your mother, for your daughter. 
It is for all ages. And look, I take my little traveling size everywhere I go. And it does smell lovely. And I did pull the pin on accident. As you can see, it fell. But don't worry, no bombs went off. Okay, this one, I think I've had it since high school and it is all gone and I've never replaced it. It doesn't last long on me, but it does smell really good and it's a pretty bottle. All right, this is Juicy Gator. This is a classic one and they have made so many other ones and it does smell really good. I used to wear this in college and it has the J for Jen. So yeah, this one, I recommend it more for like a teenager, someone that's in high school. It's a really fun bottle and it does smell really good. This one, it is a cheap perfume. Another one that smells like a stripper, but like a fun stripper. <laughs> this one, I think I got it at, at Ross. I'm not sure, but I was traveling and I forgot my perfume and I'm like, you know what, what the heck, let me go with this. And I like the bottle and it does smell good, but I would not recommend it. Not even for your daughter, not even for a teen. Yeah, stay away from this. This one, Crush, is a good bottle. Oh my gosh, I just noticed my nail. I chipped it. I try to do my nails and try to look cute for you guys. Try to be YouTube ready. This one, I forgot what it smells like. Let me smell it. Mm. This one, it does smell good. So I do recommend it for like a teenager or someone in high school. Uh, but this one, Victoria's Secret perfumes, they don't last on me. So I don't know. Give me your thoughts. Comment below. Do Victoria's Secret bottles perfumes last on you? Or is it just me that I can't smell it? My, I can't smell myself. Does that happen to you guys? Like, you can't smell yourself. So if I can't smell myself, I'm not going to waste my money because I buy perfume so I can smell myself, so I can smell good, and others can smell me too. Okay, this one, I filled it up with that perfume, Prada, that smells like cotton candy, and I have a little bit left, and I don't recommend it. The Prada one doesn't last long on me but yeah this is just the little refill that came with it it was for free i think i got rid of it this one it is one of my favorite ones it's one of my most expensive bottles i'm not sure uh the price of it but this one was a gift for my son and this one i love to wear it when i'm in bed in my pjs my silky pjs when i'm just Getting ready for bed. I love wearing this. I know for bed, right? Who can smell me? Well, my husband can smell me. I can smell myself. And I spray my wrist. And it's just a classy scent. Okay, this one. It's Miami Glow by J.Lo. And this one, it is a discontinued bottle. I only wear this in the summer. I love this bottle. And I like to mix it. With this one heavenly it's an oil by Victoria's Secret and it smells really lovely and I just love this combo if you guys can get a hold of these bottles get them like like this one sometimes I'll have it at the outlets and then I'll grab two and I always like like by the end of the summer I'm gonna be like right over here and this one will be like down here down below so yeah, these are my favorite, my favorite scents for the summer that I do recommend. So yeah, get them, you guys. And I recommend this for everyone for the summer. Uh, it doesn't matter the age. This is so much fun. It is summer. It's like screaming, summer, summer, buy that. Look, it even comes with the chanclas, <laughs> the little thongs. It's so, so cute. Let's talk about this one. This is another of my favorite ones. This is... Uh, sugar. pink sugar yeah this one it's cotton candy and i normally don't wear the perfume but they discontinued the spray for the hair so i'm like you know what i'm just gonna buy the perfume for uh, a teenager someone in high school it's just for fun for everyone and it, it smells like cotton Let's candy over here this one i just got this last year 
It is from Sephora and uh, it smells really lovely, but look, it kind of broke on me. So I don't wear it as often, but the shimmer, the actual glitter inside, it is a little rough on your body. Um, but it does smell really good. Like it says champagne, a dream champagne. This is just for fun. It's a little pricey. I, I don't recommend it, but, um, yeah, just go spray yourself at Sephora and give me your thoughts. Do you guys have this? Let me know. Maybe I should exchange it. You think they'll still do that? Because, uh, it's like, it's, that's annoying. But anyway, all right, this bottle is one of my favorites. This is a classic Miss Dior. It is such a wonderful smell. This scent, it is, I don't know, but it smells very classy. This is for a sexy, wifey, girlfriend, mother. I don't recommend it for teenagers. This is very classy, like for dinner. Let's go out. This is another classy one for dinner. This one, I love taking this one to Vegas. It's like, it smells rich, expensive, uh, and it's not even that much. It's Salvador Ferragamo. The Sig Signoria, this one, it's just, it's lovely. I love this scent. And when I wear it, it smells different on me than on other people. So people really compliment me on that one. Gucci. Let's talk about Gucci. This is the Blom. The uh, Blom? I mean, Bloom. <laughs> I almost said Bomb. All right. This one. It's like flowers. I love this one. I only spray this one at night on my wrist. And because the scent, it doesn't smell. I don't wear it to work. This one's a little travel size that I bought. Again, I needed something because I was traveling. And uh, it doesn't last long, but I love it. It smells delicious. It smells like flowers. I recommend it for everyone. But try it. If it the scent doesn't last, then don't buy it. Always try the perfumes. Okay, this one, Happy by Clinique. This is, I've been wearing this since high school. And I, I always go back to it and look, I do wear it. This one's my summer perfume to go, um, to go to. Is that how you say it? My to go to for summer also. Just when I'm feeling happy. I use this when I do my yoga. Okay, I have another Dior bottle. This one, I have never replaced it. It's been like gone. I just saved the bottle. This one's another classic one. It smells amazing. They have different ones. Let's see, this one's the Attic, Dior Attic. And this one, it is amazing. I do recommend it for a gift. It's very... It's not like a statement one, but it's a very classic, like your girlfriend, your mother, everyone. Yeah, even teenagers. This is a good scent that goes well for everyone. And these are just my opinions. But Cartier, this is another one of my most expensive perfumes. Another gift from my son. He loves to get me designer perfumes. And... This one, oh, I love how this one smells. I forgot I had it, you guys. Um, I like to wear this just when I go shopping. Like an everyday perfume. I love it. It smells like roses. I recommend that one for everyone. And when they wrap it, it's so pretty. And it's like, who doesn't want to receive a gift from Cartier, right? So yeah, I forgot I had it. I haven't used it in a while. This one, it is a classic one. It is another Dior perfume. Um, I don't know the name of it, but this one, it is for, for, um, anyone over like 28. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. It's like more classy, very settled perfume. And I love it. I used to use this. Yeah. Almost every day too. Yeah, it's just a very classy perfume. Hey friends, I did not know this video was gonna take this long, but if you're really into perfumes and appreciate 
how I appreciate perfumes and colognes and stuff like that. I get it from my parents. I will be showing you my mom's collection and my dad's collection on another day, another video. If you like perfumes, let me know. Please comment below. And like I promised, since Sephora is not doing any for, any more like free samples, this store, okay, I found it. Like we we're just walking by on Valley Fair and it smelled so good. It smelled so fresh. They have candles and I didn't know. Originally, I just went because of the candles, but they're a little pricey, like, like very pricey. So then I'm like, okay, I won't do a candle. And I really did smell the candles and, and it wasn't me, but the perfumes. Oh my gosh. My daughter fell in love with one. I fell in love with the one. So it is a Dipti Paris, Paris in Spanish. Dip, Dipti Paris. It's, it's Paris. I'm in my Paris theme room. It's like, oh my gosh, what a coincidence. But yeah, they gave me a little baggie with free samples. The guy was amazing. So let me show you guys. It was a little box like this that they gave us with a free, a little, um, lotion and then the little bottle of perfume. So the one that I picked that was my favorite, that's going to, I'm going to go purchase this for for summer it's uh do sun dead <laughs> the toilet <laughs> i don't know but diptyque paris made in france this is made in france do sun oh my gosh i'm horrible with reading things from paris and so this is the one that i'm gonna get and then my daughter she got a little card this one the El Rose, you Rose. This one was, um, it's their signature one. Like the other one, the other one, why I loved it, it's because to me it smells like gar Garnia? Gardenian, Gardenian flowers. I love the smell of Gardenian flowers. But like I said, I get ants if I put up the candle and I was telling the guy that I was getting ants and other customers had the same problem with those candles that smell like Gardenian. So it wasn't just me. But um, see, I'm getting an itch. I don't like ants. Ugh. Anyway, so this one's going to be my daughter's perfume. This one smells like the Westin Hotel in Hawaii. To me, it reminds me of Hawaii. It smells so fresh and clean and flowers. So yeah, I'm going to be buying her this one probably for Christmas and yeah I've been wearing the perfume and it does last and drum roll okay my signature perfume since 2020 yeah or 2021 I've been using it my everyday perfume my to go to perfume that everybody compliments me on where did you get it What's the smell? You smell lovely like everyone. If I'm shopping, if I'm going to church, uh, everyone. Okay, this one. It is the YSL and it is the, the I just call it the darker bottle, but the name is uh, Libre, Libre, Libre. <laughs> so... <laughs> Sorry guys, I'm so bad. But yeah, it's the YSL. It smells amazing. I spray it in my front, spray it in the back of my neck, my wrists, and then I'm ready to go. This is a classy scent. This is me. I finally found my, my scent for this era, for this chapter of my life. And yeah, I recommend it for everyone that's mature, classy, sassy, like me, like with great personality. Yes, not for your teenagers, no. Maybe for your mom. And then also, let's talk about Chanel. Why I don't have Chanel? Because I'm not old enough to have Chanel perfumes. Chanel perfumes smell like my grandmother. Yeah, a classy older lady. So when I turn 80, I will start wearing Chanel. But right now, mm -mm, I'm too young. It's not me. Chanel, yeah, it's too, too granny. Yeah, 
All right, that's it, you guys. Thank you so much. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget, give me thumbs up. Let me know which perfume are you buying for yourself, for your wife, for your girlfriend, your fiance, your sister. I don't know. Let me know. Comment below. Bye.